Hi, good morning year 10 and welcome, welcome to week 2 of lockdown. A few notices today before our tutor activity. Right guys, so the notices and the things you need to know, basically the same. I want to talk just a bit about the wider world and your duty uh, this week and next week is definitely to just stay inside year 10. Things are getting a bit scarier on the news, obviously like a few members of the government have got corona now. Um, and I know in hospitals, the number of people dying from it is just picking up and up and up. So it looks like we're getting to the worst stage of it. And during the worst stage, what you need to do is just stay in. Just, just make sure you stay out of the way. Don't pass it on to anyone. And if everyone stays in, it's going to be more manageable for everybody. Um, and it will be over faster as well. So your duty as citizens of this country, year 10, is to stay in this week and that's where our uh, discussion time activity will go to just before that though just want to talk about routines obviously we're telling you stay in your normal school routine that's what i do every day i work 8 30 to 4 because that's what mr Hume told us to do and i really enjoy that like that normality to the day is great and over the weekend like i'm making this on sunday morning i, I didn't like not having that sort of rigid pattern it was rubbish to be honest so i'll be happy when monday morning restarts all right, so keep the routine in the day, but have you thought about your evenings as well? Because your year group is the most important year group now, and you'll be most affected by this. So what about your homework? You still need to do that. If you finish your lessons at three, you still need to work in like two hours of homework a night, and you need to work in what you're going to do for the rest of that time. So why don't you create a routine for the evenings as well to get yourself in the right frame of mind to make sure you're studying hard enough and to make sure when you get to year 11, you're confident and ready for the challenge ahead of you. Yeah, so that is my advice to you today. Create routines for the evenings as well as keep into the normal school day. All right, and then I've said reward yourself. So what I like to do is if I've done a lot of good work, I'll watch something I want to watch on TV. And that is what I've got next. All right, so to reward myself, um, at night you might watch a program or line something up or I might have something to look forward to, like watch a few episodes of something and say, oh, I really want to watch the next one. Tell you what, after I've done all my work, I'll treat myself to another episode of that. So I've got some picks up here from Netflix, some things I really recommend you have a watch out. I've tried to pick things I thought you might not know about, like being younger than me. I've gone for some older like comedies and some old classics that I think you'll really, really love. So the first one, Derry Girls, this is on Channel 4 not long ago. It's a really good comedy about growing up in this part of Ireland. Um, like in the 80s and the early 90s. It's really funny. It's got some really good lines. Highly recommend Derry Girls. It's got something for everyone that program. Second one is a bit more left field. We loved this when I was at uni. It's called Peep Show and it's about these two guys down there who are just two weirdos like in very different ways. They live in a flat in Croydon and they just have just, just mad lives. It's a bit more of like a dark comedy like it's funny but should you be laughing and but it's really really good there's like eight seasons of that and they're all six episodes each so if you watch from season one or, or series one you'll really get into it peep show it is funny it is dark it's got everything now talking about dark and these <laughs> dark times um to cheer yourself up you might want to have a little look at any of the black mirrors and i'm sure you've heard of these you've probably watched some of these they were on channel 4 or somewhere on netflix right and black mirror like is a dystopian vision or a dystopian story of something and there's some crazy stories that are dark and really make you think like the first 10 minutes quite often i'm like what is going what is this about but then it sort of draws you in and then by the end it's just like shocking so black mirror is an exceptional program there's loads and loads and loads of them on netflix give it a go all right so two more these are really old these but i think you'll like them the office is this cringe comedy about this boss who Ricky Gervais created the character and he's just an awful boss in these 90s office if you look at how they dress you can see how old this is and the no smoking sign stuck up inside like you need that these days so you can see just how old this is but it is still funny it stood the test of time give it a watch it is just non-stop like cringe comedy You're just like oh my god how did he say that but it is really worth watching and it will cheer you up as well. It's always got like a nice ending. It will cheer you up at the end of like a tough day or if your family are getting you annoyed. All right, and finally, the big recommendation, friends, I've just put in the description, 
it's friends if you've not watched friends before i, I don't know what planet you've lived on um but the good thing about friends right is it's always nice and it's always sort of a light and it cheers you up it's never like dark or troubling even when things go wrong it is still like funny and light and entertaining and just like whenever you're down or like your family are getting on your nerves watching a few episodes of friends will just sort of pick you up and make you feel happier so i can't recommend it enough good thing about friends as well is like it's like 20 series of it so it just goes on forever even in quarantine i don't think you can watch them all so highly recommended right guys that's tutor time for today make sure you do your work before you get onto netflix and watch some of these so we want a normal school day from you make sure you go for your homework in the evening and then you'll still have loads of time to kill this is a great way to kill some time and reward yourselves right guys see you tomorrow